Well, you must be delighted to have signed a new contract. People probably forget how young you are, and it's just a, another another step on your journey. Yeah, I'm really happy to sign a new contract. I um, feel like I've worked hard for it. I've shown what I can do, shown the gaffer what I can do, and hopefully I've shown the fans what I can do as well. Yeah, because you've been around here for so long, you started at such a, a young age. It hasn't all gone your way as yet, but presumably you've been plugging away all the way through? Yeah, I feel like um, just before I got the injury, I feel like I've nailed enough cement in my place in the team and so people had to fight to take the shirt off me. I didn't lose a shirt like by performance wise but injury. But that's football, it happens. Just gotta try to win the shirt back when I'm back fit. Yeah, that must have been a hugely frustrating week to have had that great performance at Portsmouth and then you're thinking, I'm um, building some momentum, I've got a place in the side and go and get a freak injury. Yeah, like um I started from Ipswich in the in the cup, then Portsmouth. And I was feeling like this is this is me, like I'm showing consistency, I'm playing. There's Bolton next game. I was in a really good place. Then the injury happened, it set me back a few. But it's football, just got to get back stronger, which I've been doing. So I feel like if I get back in, I'll be ready again. Yeah, the good news is your eye looks back to normal. Are you feeling good? Yeah, I'm feeling much better than before. Like when it happened, I was in a bad place, but plugged away and it's healed really quickly. So hopefully, just about adapting to it and getting the best out of what I can do. Yeah, because that must have been really tough at the time. The expectation was that you were going to be out for a, a long, long while. Yeah, um, shout out to the doctor, um, Professor Holmes. Like, he did a great job and his team. I was literally, as soon as the op, I could see like 100 times better. <laughs> I was happy about that. Was it actually a bit scary at the time? Because it, it doesn't really fit into the, car the category of a, an ordinary injury. Yeah, because like, it's not a football injury. Like When you injure your legs, like... It's football, like it's not a life injury. But when you injure your eyes, that's everything, everything to do with life. Like you can't see. Had to walk around with only my right eye closed every day, so it was hard to adapt. But it's literally just about life. I'm just happy I can see now. That's the main thing. When it comes to signing your new contract, presumably no hesitation at all, given the momentum you've been building. No, like with the way Peter is moving forward, the gaffer. I've been there for a while. I'm used to it. It's close to home. Everything's pros when it comes to the contract. Yeah, and when you were first at the club, Grant McCann, a, a big fan of your work, and then it seems that since day one, since Darren's been here, he's really given you that belief and he's believed in you. I've, as soon as I've come into the building, I've given the gaffer 100% faith. I've trained hard every day, every session. If I'm not in the team, if I'm not in the squad, I work extremely hard. So I've tried to repay the faith as best as I can. Yeah, and you presumably found that enjoyable as well. I've enjoyed it since being back from loan. I've worked hard and I fitted into the system well. Yeah, did you always believe that as a wing back that could be a role that would work for you? I feel like um, with my physical attributes and the way I play the game, I'm a strong runner, I can get beat players one by one and I can make like, a correct decision when I'm out there. And even when I played 10, I thought I could do, I did a good job there as well. Yeah, it's crucial, isn't it, in both of those positions to to make the right decisions and to make the right assessments in the split second. Yeah, that's all it is, like decision making like at high speeds because with the way I play, I'm running at players, I'm running fast, I'm running in behind. So it's just about making that correct decision at a high intensity. Moving forward, where do you think you will fit in best? As you say, you've done the number 10 role, you've also played as a, a forward as well, you've played as a, a wing back, you've got that versatility. Um, moving forward, that's... I'm in a good situation because I'm so versatile. So whoever the gaffer puts me, I'll put in 110% and I'll put in a good performance, hopefully. Yeah, and I guess you'll have seen what the likes of Sammy and Sariki have been doing in the team at the moment. Looks as though that's a, a role that could suit you quite well, that skill set. Yeah, I'm, I'm buzzing for them, especially Sammy and Dems. They've come back into the team and they're doing really well. I feel like I can do the same, but wherever I play, if I play on the right wing back, I'll be up and down. Oh, 1v1s all game long. No. And this weekend coming a little too soon for you, but next weekend should be good to go? Yeah, um, hopefully I should be back into training t um, tomorrow. Um, training Saturday and next week, four weeks of training. And hopefully available for selection on Saturday.